It seemed like a normal day until I got on the mountain and then while we were up there on the gondola, we noticed a helicopter going overhead. By helicopter and by foot, first responders and ski patrols continuing their search Thursday for a 49-year-old man from Toronto. City News in Toronto tells NBC5 that the missing man is a firefighter who was skiing with a mixture of retired and off-duty firefighters who say they found his belongings in the lodge and his vehicle in the parking lot Wednesday afternoon. John Lundeen with the Olympic Regional Development Authority says friends reported the man missing around 4.30 p.m. We have an extensive search. Um, um, that's been covering the mountain from summit to base uh, and uh, we have about uh, 35 uh, different uh, people from various agencies on the hill today uh, in searching for this individual. Lundeen says the recent snow and the fact that it's unclear what trail the skier was riding on are making the search more difficult. Skiers and riders say the news of the disappearance is shocking. It's scary to think of somebody being lost up there. Everybody in the mountain was talking about it so they hope they find the person that we lost so it's really sad. Skier Rudy Younger says people on the slopes are trying to help. Everybody's looking over the edge and trying to see if they can find something, a color jacket, anything, but uh, so far I don't think they found anything, so really sad. He says he saw search crews combing the area. Uh, the ski patrol had dogs uh, trying to you know, sniff them out. It's pretty wild coming down a trail and all of a sudden you got a giant helicopter above you. He and skier Devin Klein are just hoping for the best. So really sad. I just hope he's all right.